jumpstart today talking about unexpected lessons. The other night, I was at my six-year-old grandson's baseball game. The parents had been squabbling about what the correct score was. It was intense. Austin's team was winning by two runs. In Little League, the coach of whatever team is batting stands on the pitcher's mound and releases balls to his players from a pitching machine. So, my grandson's team is in the outfield, and the other team has the bases loaded. There are two outs. The batter from the other team hits a hard rolling ball to the shortstop on our team. And before our kid can get the ball in his glove, the kid on third base scores. To keep the lead, our kid needs to get the ball and run to home plate to tag out the tying run. Miraculously, he tags him. We keep the lead. Disappointed moans are heard from the bleacher of the parents from the other team. And you are not going to believe what the coach from the other team did. He runs up to our kid, the one that tagged his kid out at home plate, and with amazing enthusiasm, high fives our kid and tells him what an incredible play he just made. So today, let's ask him to help us be more like Coach Jim Montour, who not only taught every parent in those stands what true, authentic, unadulterated, civilized sportsmanship looks like, but also for recognizing that you will sometimes lose baseball games, but you won't ever lose when you shape six-year-old boys with encouragement that inspires confidence. Are you choosing to make it a good day? I'm so glad. I'll see you next time.